So I first got to know Jerry May in the summer of 2005 when I was invited to be a guest faculty member at the Big Ten Fundraisers Institute. He was just this incredibly warm and gregarious guy who was the consummate networker, really demonstrating the great skills that he had as a fundraiser and getting to know other people and building that rapport and trust and respect amongst all of the participants. He's had the good fortune of serving the University of Michigan twice, bookending uh, a stint at Ohio State University. He has left his mark not only on the physical plant of the campus, but the way in which he has built his teams, I think has a long lasting legacy for our profession writ large. One of the things that Jerry worked very hard to develop with his colleagues at the University of Michigan is a really substantive internship program. There are very few academic programs to teach someone how to be uh, a development leader or an advancement leader. The internship program that Jerry helped put together, it's been remarkably successful at Michigan. They have already had over 300 undergraduate students go through that program. It's been replicated at a lot of institutions, including ours here at UCLA. And we have found that the template for that internship program, adapted for each individual school culture, has created an entire group of young people to flourish on our campus that has cross-populated all of the campuses that participate. For that, I think our entire profession is all the better. That willingness to be generous, I think, is, um, in my mind, the most remarkable contribution he's made. Whether it's case conferences and case leadership roles, or whether it's the Big Ten Development Conference or the Big Ten Fundraising Institute, his energy for supporting learning across the profession and his commitment to advancement is one that I think inspires the rest of us to carry that forward. Jerry loves engaging with people. He loves student interns. He loves working with major donors. He loves working with academics. And in some ways, he's teaching us all. He just finds great joy in being able to turn those relationships into something productive. His humility comes through in every interaction as well. He's really interested in who he's meeting on their terms. He brings an infectious enthusiasm about the work in such a way that he can bring people closer and build that kind of web of people who together then form the fabric of our profession.